so this is the base it's a 14 by 20 if you look well you will see that i have measured everything on it so as not to have problem when fixing it you see it's only one piece of it it's a 14 by 20 then the back it's a 12 by 20 all this graduation is an inch it's only one piece this one too but you need to measure them correctly so that you fix them well this is a 12 by 14 it's for the sides here and the center so there are three of this stuff you have three of it there's one two three and this three is 12 by 14 inch this is the wrapping paper you need to wrap them up so as you can see we are done wrapping them so this is my base this is the division of the compartment I want to create and this is my back this is the back it's going to be fixed in the center you know I wanted to fix it at the back before but I changed the style of what I wanted to create so I'm going to be applying my top bond you know, to the piece to put the piece but if I have made any mistake or something I should add just do well to drop your comments in the comment box down below. After applying the top one to both the pieces, now you have to apply pressure on the piece while joining them until it's a little bit dry before you can release your support so that it doesn't collapse. Then you do the same thing to the remaining three pieces. Here is the look. I've connected all of them, but I had to divide one of the 14 by 12 in order to get that center piece. This, I'm forgetting the compartment and the drawer. We have an 8 by 8. This is 8 by 8. We have three of these two for the division and one for making the drawer. Please do well to watch till the end so that you see how it looks like. We have 6 by 8. Three of these just note all of these calculations are in inch two for division and one for compartment we have four eight by ten as you can see we have an eight by ten two for division and two for the locker we also have a four six by ten by this six by ten four of it two for division and two for compartment. Feel free to pause this video and rewind so that you can understand. I've wrapped these pieces that I showed you before, and this is how it looks like. So now I have to fix all of them and I will show you the completed picture. I've fixed the partitions like this. Let me bring the phone closer. I'm the phone closer so that you see how. So these are the partitions and everything. Yeah, this is how it is both ways. Both ways, this is how it is. So I didn't bother painting these ones because they are already white. No need to paint them or put any covering on it like this one so you can see. So now I just have to make a locker that I'll put inside these places. Yes. So these are the ones I'll just use and fix them like this and probably deform. And that will deform something like this. Where you can put on the inside this place. Okay. Trying to show you how I fix the gum and put up the locker so that it will look like a locker. See?
now it looks like locker is starting to look like a drawer actually yeah I am going to use them as the handle for pulling them out. I made it from the same string I told my daughter to with blue and pink tape. I'm going to fix them to the already made lockers. I'm done fixing all of the lockers. You can see them. Six of them here. You can see four pink and two blue. Actually, it's supposed to be three pink and three blue, but I made one pink already, so it's pink. That's why I have only four polar that is blue and two that is pink. So this is the handle and I'm going to fix them. I'll fix one and put the top bond on it and then you fix it to the locker and then I'll do the same to the others. I'll use my push pins to assist the handle from behind. So our project is almost done. I didn't bother covering up this place because it's going to be hidden and it's mine obviously and I didn't want to waste my covering paper. This part is a little bit deeper than this other side because this is the 10 by 6 and 8 by 6 so this blue is going to be for this side of it I was saying now I think it before the other side anyway let's fix and see this is for this here and this goes for this This is going to be like empty and I look more to do to this. So let's go to the other side. And go for single here. And this goes here, does it? Does it here? Let's try this here. This way I'm going to be fixing it. You see how cluttered this one is cut out. So, <laughs> yeah, that's my soap. So I'm going to be arranging it in that organizer. Let's see how it's going to be. My things with extra things, extra space. So, by all means, let's see, how to even space them so that it wouldn't look empty. You can now have easy access to my earrings and other things. Any more things I print, I can keep here instead of having a clutter. 
By all means, like the video. That if you like it, and don't forget to subscribe. Yeah, do it's not my regular, but once in a while, when I make things, I'm going to put the video for you. Don't forget, my channel is a health channel, and health topic we shall be coming in on a more regular basis than videos like this. So do well to subscribe. It's gonna help you. Yeah, thank you.